Okay, folks, everybody welcome tonight. We'll come to pray and seek God. And we're going to have a, a fantastic time tonight. There's a couple of thoughts that came into my mind while I was just preparing for this. And uh, one of them I got in Psalms 136. And I love this. It says, Oh, give thanks to the Lord for his good, for his mercy endures forever. Oh, give thanks to the gods for his mercy endures forever. Verse 3 says, Oh, give thanks to the Lord for his mercy endures forever. Four says, to him alone does wonders. Isn't that beautiful? Mm -hmm. To him alone, for his mercy endures forever. To him by the wisdom made the heavens, for his mercy endures forever. To him who laid out the earth above the waters, for his mercy endures forever. To him who made great lights, for his mercy endures forever. The sun ruled by day, for his mercy endures forever. The moon and the stars ruled by night, for his mercy endures forever. Isn't that beautiful? You see, the thing is that you and I, we need to be thankful, have a thankful heart. Because when you find something to be thankful heart, it changes everything. And I, as I was preparing this, I thought, what am I going to, what am I going to say? What, what, what's, what, what, what do you come in? And I found something else as well. And I thought, Lord, and I love this. And this thought came to my mind. It says, every problem is an opportunity for God. I'll say that again. Every problem is an opportunity for God. And I found this in Psalms 139, 17 and 18. It says, how precious are your thoughts to me, God? How great is the sum of them? If I should count them, there will be more than number than the sand. When I wake, I'm still with you. So we serve a God that's created the heavens, created the stars, created everything, and he answers prayer. He is a God that will answer prayer. And I don't know if you remember seeing this video that came up recently, and it just came to my mind. And I know Denise isn't here tonight. She's busy on something else. Do you remember the video that came on recently? And it was about this preacher guy, right? And this guy is a preacher now, but before he got saved, he was an alcoholic. He was a drug addict. And now he's teaching about healing. And what happened was, is that, you know, coming through the story, right? As he started thanking God and moaning and said, I'm moaning and complaining, he found something to be thankful for. This man got healed. And now he's a pastor. And now he's serving God. And now he's not a drug addict anymore. Now he's, now he's somebody that is preaching the gospel. So the point I'm trying to make is, we've got so much to be thankful for. Would you agree with me? You told about that house group last year, Mick, to remember. Yeah, did I? Did I? Yeah. <laughs> you, don't, you don't remember? <laughs> yeah, you're reading from your old notes. <laughs> oh, I've, got, I've got brand new ones here, trust me. No, it, just, it just goes to show. All right, Bill, I'll give me a clip around the ear now. <laughs> no, 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 it just goes to show that what I'm, I'm going saying, for. Right? And the thing is that, what we're going to do tonight is that I'm not going to do all the talking here tonight. This is, Thank this is God. Very, right? Thank God. <laughs> I'm not going to do all the talking. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up, first of all, I'm going to open up the floor. I mean, thank God that we're able to do this soon, right? Thank God that there's one, two, three, four, five, six of us here tonight, right? And, we're, and the Holy Spirit is here, and we're able to, to be able to pray online. You know, we're, we're warm, we're sitting in a warm house, we've got the central heating on, and we've got a lot to be thankful. There's people that haven't got homes. There's people that haven't got food in their bellies. So we have the breath that we breathe. I mean, Billy, we're just talking before and joking and having fun. You know, God loves a grateful heart. He does. I find in my own life, and I'm not the only one here, if I'm moaning and groaning, what's the difference between an optimist and a pessimist? An optimist says that the glass is half full. A pessimist says it's half empty. So when we start moaning and complaining and start giving praise and thanks to God, the whole situation changes. I find that in my own life. So I'm going to open up tonight before we go into prayer. You know, I'm expecting you all to pray, so I don't have to do anything tonight, really. Just listen to you all. <laughs> We're going to open with some praise reports. Anybody want to give us some praise reports? Come on. Yeah, let's thank God for the... Uh... The turning of events with the vaccine uh, is being rolled out in many countries now. So let's pray that this is the beginning of the end of the coronavirus. 
Yeah. And not just depending on that, but trusting in God, having faith in God and keep us safe in it. And I just thank God that through it all, we've been kept safe. Fantastic. And I, I've written that down myself. I've written that down myself, and I, I wrote down, it's an answer to our prayers. Mm -hmm. Really, it is. Because remember when we were praying, we were actually praying for a vaccine to be found. And how many know that God answers prayers? This happened. And the thing is, that it's happening now. And every time I see it, you see the Holy Spirit is omnipresent. We know that. We're all Christians here. And, and what, what, the Holy Spirit can go everywhere all at once. And I firmly believe that he's answered our prayers. And, I, and, and, you know, and I'm praying and believing God that people will take this, you know, and there's loads of more prayers to, that I've written. Anybody else got any more praise reports? Yeah, thank God, because I've had the first jab. Good man. When yeah, I've had the vaccine, I've had the first jab, yeah. Right. That's a blessing. The second day I got it. Yeah, very good. Good, good chosen one. Very, very good. Anybody else? I got to go for the second one on the 30th. Come on, Ken. Ken. It's froze again. <laughs> Ken is smiling. He's yeah, you, you are. <laughs> Billy. Ken is smiling. And he's froze. <laughs> You're breaking up fairly badly. I'm all, I, I just get all that. Uh, 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 words here, but right. Okay, well that's good, Alan. That you've had it. That's uh, you, you can be a guinea pig. Amen. Yeah. We've got the second one on the thirtieth. Anyway, so yeah. And now, have you have you had any side effects? I did for a day, but it went good. It's worth the protection. Sort of the problem that I had with hernia came out a bit. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. But the day after it went. No. Good. Good. I thank God for our Jennifer. She's um, been suffering with her, her problem. And it's been driving her mad. So the earliest they could get her in for a, a scan was February. And it's just, it wasn't good enough. So we've been getting with her praying. And, and she's been turning to God a lot. And, uh, you know, even started praying in tongues, you know, and she said she felt a lot better. But then we prayed with her. And then when we got home with her, there was a letter in the, in the, in the post box. And it was for um, an appointment at the Bolton Royal for an MI, MRI test. Oh, good. Within three days. Brilliant. Well, put for an emergency bill, yeah. Well, it was in a way. It's just yeah. that... You know, it was driving her psychologically mad. But anyway, so, but she'd been, the doctor told they weren't putting in for MRI, they were putting her in for a, this other scan. And, uh, you know, so it, it kind of came out of the blue, but within the same hour as we prayed with her. So anyway, she's been last Friday. She's waiting on the results now, but they can more or less told her there's nothing to worry about. So it's put her at ease now. I mean, she's still got a lot wrong behind her ear, but it's not. I think half the battle now is that she knows she, it's nothing, you know, nothing to worry about. So I thank God for that because it was driving her mad. Mm. Yeah. That's good. That's, That's good, Bill. Yeah. Well, it. for me, uh, uh, can you hear me? Can yeah. You hear me? Yeah, go ahead. Uh, today, um, my uh, uh, central heating has been fixed. It's been on the blimp for about a week now. Um, I, 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 fortunately, uh, through it all, I have been able to uh, keep the house uh, uh, warm. Uh, today, I, I got a, a new uh, a, 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 a thermostat, which appears to be all right, so I'm very pleased about uh, yes. that. Uh, God has uh, uh, graciously helped me to complete the uh, the the, uh, the roofing at, at submission. Day. Uh, so there's 
uh, as something that we can pray for again. Um, yeah. That we will yeah. receive a, a favor now. It's all, as far as uh, as we are concerned, as far as our church is concerned, it's over with, it's in. Uh, it has been acknowledged that they have it. Uh, so we are, are, are seeking now um, a, a, a God's a, 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 a blessing that, that we will uh, receive a, 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 a favor uh, for that. Plus that there's, all, there's always the ongoing joy of the presence of the Lord and thanks for all that he does for me. I, I, I take every day as being <laughs> with uh, uh, the Lord and I thank him for that. So we praise God. Amen. Yeah. Does anybody else want to say anything that they want to be give praise for before we go into prayer? Anybody else? It's all breaking up, mate. It is. It is. Okay then. It's, you can hear me perfect, can't you? Yeah. It's kind of breaking up, isn't it? It's can you hear me now, Philip? Sorry. It's you can breaking. Can you hear me? One second. Give me one second. Just wait there one second. I won't be a second. Get preparation to sew up. That we've got to go back to the dentist to discuss what to do. Really. Mm. You know? Well, it says in, in, in Philippians, can you hear me? Four, yeah. six, and seven. Just be yeah. anxious for nothing. For everything in prayer, supplication, with thanksgiving. There's that thanksgiving again. Let your quest be made known unto God. And listen to this. And the peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, will guard your hearts and minds through Christ Jesus. So we're going into prayer requests. Anybody else got any prayer requests that they want to pray for tonight? I've got a few here, but I want you to... To write, tell me yours. I've got, um, I've got the church roof. I've got Alan's dad's tooth. Yeah, I've got my brothers. Um, they need to continue to be uplifting in prayer. Morris, Terry, and Alan, all different things. Mm -hmm. Pray for our Alan to get some so progress. How, how is um? We want to pray for your two brothers, don't we? Three. How is Jennifer now? Sorry, your three brothers. How is Jennifer now, Billy? Is she good now? She's doing good, yeah. She's uh, she's doing really good. We'll continue to pray for Jennifer and and uh, and. Uh, I have already mentioned it while you was out, so. <laughs> did you? Okay, man. Oh. I'm, I'm just writing it down here so that we can go into prayer. Anybody else want to pray? Has your brother got some little operation, Bill? Eh? Has your brother got some operation on his back or something? No, he, uh, my eldest one's had surgery and he's, oh, yeah. Yeah. he's doing good. Oh, yeah. Me, me, um, the next one, Morris, he's got in touch with some something. I think it's like, they say it's a break, breakthrough for prostate cancer. It's going to cost him a lot of money, but I think he'd go in this Friday for an interview. Right. And then it, the next one, if they take him on, then next one he's got to go to... Um, I think London. Oh so yeah, we're just praying that it's suitable for him. Oh yeah, you know. And the other one, Alan, he's still in hospital. Oh. He's had a stroke. It's pretty oh. bad, I think. But none of us can go in to see him. But oh, I'm spot. I think he's glad, really, because he doesn't want us to see him the way he is. I don't know. You can understand he, that, can't you? Yeah. 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 Hey, is he? Uh, 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 fully uh, uh, conscious, Bill. As he, uh, oh yeah, there's nothing wrong there. Lost any just... of his uh, facility? Any? Yeah, he can't. He, he's he, he, he's got a slurred voice and he's lost use of his legs at the moment. Right. And I think his right arm or his left arm. I'm not sure. One of them. Right. But they've got hope. They, I mean, he can get up if two two of the assistants have to help him. And he's slowly getting up off on his feet. He no, should have no, no. originally. It was planned that he came home on the eleventh. But prayer requests. Anybody? 
Oh, just out, out, out praying for successful uh, service on uh, uh, Sunday. Yeah, it's, yeah. The carol service is it? It's a, a, the carol service, is it? Not really. We're just singing some Christmas songs, and then yeah. preaching. Yeah. Oh, it's very limited this year because of the COVID. But. Yeah, it's, it's hard. It's hard. Well, we, we, I have I've written that down as well. You know, just to be grateful to be back in church. You know, so we're going to continue praying for that. Mm. Um, anybody else? I've got no, a few. Right, anybody right. else? We're going to continue praying for Betty. It, it, it's Bev's family funeral this Thursday. No, it's on Monday, twenty first. It's Monday. coming Monday. But we're going to pray for that. You know, Bev's Bev's uh, Bev's family funeral. Yeah. And yeah, we'll it's a grandson Daniel. Grandson Daniel, isn't it? I'm just writing this down so I get it right. So just. Is he the one? Is he, is he the one that came to church? He has been to church, yes. Mm. The one, not the one that comes with a daughter, is it? No, no. No, no, no. Not him. He's, he's, not, been, he's not been to this church. He's, he came to Gateway. Oh, right, yeah. yeah. Uh, once or twice over the years. I'm, I've right. been to visit him as well. Oh, right. You know. Yeah. I've got a... Yeah, anybody? just Sorry, go pray ahead, for his, his mum, Jennifer, you know, because... <laughs> It's very difficult for parents, isn't it, when you lose it's a child? Hard. It's terrible hard when, when you lose anyone, but uh, it's very mm. difficult, you know, when you when your children go before you. It's very very hard. It's hard to, you know. I remember when Michael and Michael died, and and uh, Noel was very upset, you know, Brady's mom. So it's kind of difficult. It's very difficult all around. So it's a tough time for people in general. There, um, we're going to continue praying for um, for the government, you know, for this decisions they're making as regards to the Brexit and, and, and in general, as regards to this, you know, the decisions that they have to make as regards to this uh, COVID, you know, so. Yeah. yeah. Look, we're, going to, we're going to believe uh, believe God for um, for protection. We're, we're, we've already prayed for, for um, you know, for God's, um, for a vaccine to be found. Well, God answered prayer, so we're just, we're just praying that uh, wisdom comes and people, you know, in general, have, have wisdom as regards to this uh, Christmas that, you know, because we're, we're in a God that's a miracle God. Mm. And Isaiah 26 3 says, God gives a perfect peace with mind to stay in him. So we, we, we've got to keep our mind and, you know, pray God's protection. Me and Billy were talking before we came on. And we do, we have to pray protection on ourselves. So is there any more prayer requests before we go into prayer? Anybody, anyone else that they want to pray for? Yeah. Anybody else? I, I want to continue praying for my sister, you know, my sister Denise, and uh, my family in Ireland, you know, and uh, protection and Paul Brady's family and all that sort of stuff. So, shall we go into prayer then? Anybody else? Yeah. Want to, I mean, shall we go into prayer? So, um, Billy, do you want to pray for um, for the church roof and for um, Alan's Alan's toots? You know, Alan's dad's toot. He's having problems with like an abscess or something, yeah. or it's an operation or something in the Alan. So, Billy, will you okay. pray for that? Because the submission has gone through now, and I actually read that down as well. So, I was actually, I was actually, what I was actually doing when upstairs uh, before, when I was preparing this, I was thanking God for the money already. I, it came to me. I, I was, I was, um, I was actually going to put it down on a praise report. That we're thanking God that the money is already here because and what came to mind to me was that everything that we applied for and I, I God brought me back to to what you shared about when you when you know the building when you needed the money to turn around and do the building up in Bright Road you know do you remember and that the money came through and it was got through and it just came to me about that and I and I believe that God's given us the building we know that you know the way things came about every step by step precinct by precinct, you know, all the money's come in. So we're serving a supernatural God. We've planted seeds. There's so much seeds gone into the building that we're going to see it happen. This, this favor has come through. It's happened before. It's going to, we're going to believe God tonight for us. And this is what we're praying for. Because when two or three are together, God is there among them. And I believe in all my heart that this is going to be enlightened so much that we're going to get the money. Because 
we're not going to have a messed up so that we don't want a temporary job. We want a permanent job. Would you agree with that? That's what we're praying for tonight. So, Billy, will you go ahead and pray for the church roof, please? And uh, Alan's dad's too, that a miracle takes place too. Hallelujah. Thank you. Father God, we just thank you right now. Lord, as we come before your throne of grace, Lord, we bring our needs before your throne. And Lord, we know that you hear us. And so we, I'm praying in, in um, yes, unison yes. with everyone else tonight, Lord, concerning the funding application that Ken sent off for the roof. Lord, it is a big problem for us on the building, but it's not a problem to you. And we're asking, Lord, for great favour, oh God, from uh, the funders. And we pray, Lord, that as they've received the application, it's on the right person's desk, Lord, that you'll give us favour, oh God, as, yes. as that goes through. We, we, we thank you in anticipation, and we say thank you, Lord, for yeah. your um, provision for each and every one of us and for that this roof will be fixed in early next year. So we thank you for that right now, oh God. And Lord, as we pray, Lord, we pray for Alan's father, Lord, and um, yeah. he's been going through a lot of problems with uh, his teeth and his gums, oh God. And hopefully they've discovered the, the best uh, route forward. And so, Lord, I just pray that he, he's not in pain, but he's in comfort, Lord, and that all this will be sorted out, and that, Lord, he'll be back to full health, oh God. And I give you praise right now for the magnificent things that you're doing in our lives. Lord, that many times we take for granted. We take for granted um, the provision that you bring in our lives, oh God, and maybe it's jobs, maybe it's uh, financial blessing, maybe it's provision coming in. Lord, we thank you, Lord God, from the top of our hearts, Lord, from the bottom of our hearts, that we come, Lord, thanking you, oh God, for your mercy, for your grace. You are our provider, Jehovah Jireh. And so we lift all this before you, and we say thank you right now, in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Um, Joseph, yes, will you pray for, um, for Billy's brothers? You know, that uh, they need a miracle, you know, and we're going to believe God for a miracle tonight. And we're going to continue also praying for um, for Jennifer and Alan. We're thanking God for Jennifer, you know, for her ears popping over, for that blockage taking place. And we're going to believe God that her faith is strengthened, you know, when she's speaking in tongues. I mean, Pastor Billy and Denise are encouraging her all the time. We're going to pray for Alan, her husband, the lovely man that's, you know, that um, he gets to know God and different things like that. And God knows, you know, so... Will you pray for Billy's brother and uh, Jennifer and Alan, please, Joseph? Okay, thank you. Thank you Heavenly Father, we thank you for a time like this in your presence. Thank you for opportunity to come together to sharpen, yes. says iron, sharpen it iron, to sharpen each other. And we thank you for the grace of, the, that you have, of life that you have given to us. Father, I accept our thanks in Jesus' name. Lord, I pray, oh God, concerning Pastor, my Pastor Bill's brothers, um, Maurice and um, Alan and Terry. Alan and Terry, oh God. Father, yeah. I pray for them, oh God. They yeah. all have, at, at the diff, they have different need, okay. but ultimately, yes. the power to heal is in your hand, oh God. Therefore, Lord, we come to you tonight, oh God, that you will, the good job that you started in the hell to oh God, that you will complete in the name of Jesus, oh God. Lord, that you will restore the yes, strength. Amen. You will restore the health, oh God. You will yes. restore the strength yes. in the name of Jesus. Amen. You will renew that strength like the eagles yes. in the name of Jesus. That through this thing that they are going through, oh God, the, yes. their heart will be drawn to you. They will seek and look more for you, oh God, in the name of Jesus. That you alone will be glorified through it all yes. in the name of Jesus. I, Lord, I speak to every part of their body from the crown of their head to the sole of their feet, they will respond to the living word of the living king and they will receive power and strength in the name of yes. Jesus because they, are, they were wonderfully and beautifully made by you, God. I declare and I prophesy upon them Shut perfect up. healing in the name of Jesus from the crown of their head to the sole yes. of their feet. For every muscle, every tissue and tendon, the water that flows through them receive total healing in the name of Jesus. The Bible says, by his stripes, 
we are made whole because Christ has done this. I, we declare tonight that it begins yes. to operate in this healing yes. in the name of Jesus. Lord, I also thank you for Jennifer. Thank you for where she is at the moment. Thank you for yes. For because we are restoring her back to you, even in our in our health as well, God, in a relationship for you with you, God. Father, be thou exalted. We thank you for where you are with her. Lord, I pray that you will complete the job that you started in her. Lord, you will complete in the name of Jesus. I pray total healing in every part of our body in the name of Jesus, God. The Bible says, I am the God of all flesh. Is anything difficult for me to do? Because there is nothing difficult for you to do. Therefore, Lord, we approach the throne of grace to obtain mercy upon Jennifer and our husband, Alan, the God. Let your hand be upon them in the name of Jesus. Let yes. the eyes behold the glory of God upon their life in the name of Jesus. Yes. Give them a new song. Put a new song upon their lips. Let yes. them dance like, a, like never before to the glory of your name. Let every eyes that behold them see the glory of God upon their life in the name yes. of Jesus. Thank yes. you, everlasting yes. Father. Thank you because you yes. always answer our prayer. Thank you because this is not going to be an exemption. Thank you, everlasting Father. We give you praise and we we'll receive with thanksgiving in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Ken, can you hear me, Ken? Yeah. Yeah, brilliant, Ken. Will you pray for um, a successful service on Sunday? You know, it's our, our last service before Christmas and that everything will go right. And we're going to pray for all the people, you know, the church members there as well. Those that can't make it, that God will protect them and look after them. You know, just add that to your prayer. Uh, also, will you pray for um, for Bev's family funeral next Monday? Is that right, Pastor Bill? Yeah. And Jennifer is uh, is Daniel's mom. Is that correct, Bill? Yeah. We're praying for Jennifer. So, would you pray for those two things for me, please? Yeah. Before I I, I do, is there another uh, the prayer meeting at the next week or is, is this oh, um, we're, we're making a prayer meeting for two weeks yeah. until, oh, until this oh, okay because i'll i'll in, include that then in, in the the prayer that i pray dear father we just uh, thank you lord for the uh, 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 the blessings that uh, mm -hmm. uh, our church and the, the the people in our church lord uh, 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 have it, uh, enjoyed, Lord, through your um, uh, provision, through uh, through uh, 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 social uh, 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 media, Lord, and also, uh, 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 Lord, for those uh, times of uh, uh, special favour, Lord, when we have uh, yeah. been able to meet personally, uh, face to face. It's been yes. a joy, Father, and Father, we uh, do. And look forward to our service on a Sunday morning, Lord, uh, uh, as we uh, uh, meet uh, uh, just before uh, 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 Christmas. Uh, uh, yeah. uh, Father, we just uh, thank you, Lord, for your provision of uh, uh, Jesus Christ for his birth, Lord. Uh, we uh, 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 thank you, Lord, for the uh, nativity, Lord, that we do have a lord and and savior who was uh, born a baby lord at at, uh, at this uh, at time of year for father and i just pray our hearts are thankful lord on uh, uh, sunday lord for your uh, 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 provision uh, we just ask lord that we're able to uh, 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 worship and uh, 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 give uh, uh, thanks, Lord, with uh, 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 grateful yeah. hearts, Lord. Father, we ask you to bless all of, of those who attend, Lord. Uh, 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 may it be a joyous uh, uh, time for for all of us, uh, Lord. And we also think of, uh, of those people uh, from our church who are uh, unable to attend lord we ask for your uh, uh, blessing upon them and and, uh, and father we just uh, 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 thank you lord for the year that has passed lord father all the uh, uh, prayer meetings that we uh, 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 have held and we uh, uh, thank you for the 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 continuing uh, prayer meetings 
uh, uh, next year, Lord. Father, we have a good uh, year to look forward to, uh, 2021, Lord, and we uh, uh, look uh, forward to it, Lord, and all the... Uh, the uh, 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 bounteous uh, uh, provision, Lord, that you have uh, uh, for us. Uh, Father, we just ask you uh, to uh, cause our church to uh, flourish, Lord, in uh, the uh, 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 people who uh, attend, Lord. Uh, 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 Father, may, may the the, uh, uh, the quality of our service and our, our, our uh, uh, worship uh, to you continue lord and in, in fact it, it increased lord because our, our desire lord in, in all things Amen. is to be, be uh, 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 pleasing to you and to uh, exalt you above all, all, all others and we just ask that we're able to do this on sunday lord and, and continue into the uh, 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 new year uh, uh, father we think of Bev Lord and her, yes. her daughter a Jennifer Lord Father Lord it's it's it, 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 difficult to imagine Lord the sorrow the the pain the Lord the uh, thinking back over events yeah. Lord all the things look a uh, 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 Lord that are entering their hearts, Lord, and that are, are giving uh, so much pain, Lord. A father, the loss of a, a child, a grandchild, uh, uh, Lord, is a terrible thing, Lord. Uh, 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 father, and we just ask you, Lord, to, Lord, bring a peace, Lord, and a comfort into their hearts, Lord. And for all of the uh, uh, family uh, that are, uh, are close to uh, Daniel Lord uh, and to uh, yeah. Jennifer and, and, and Bev, Father, uh, there are uh, and no uh, uh, words that uh, uh, we can supply that we can give, Lord, that can. Uh, uh, the, uh, that can uh, 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 counter the, the grief and yes. sorrow that uh, they feel. Uh, yes. But Father, we have a God, a God of, of, of comfort and peace, and we just ask you, Lord, that you would bless them, Lord. Bless the, the uh, family with that. Uh, Father, the, the, uh, the comfort that they have and the, yes. the joy, Lord, of, uh, 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 of knowing that you are yes in it with them lord father they are are not alone lord father we know that you grieve as well lord. and we just thank you lord that you come down and participate with us and share our sorrows and we just Thank you, Lord, that you were uh, doing that with uh, Bev and her uh, family. So, yes. uh, Father, we Jesus. commit the the funeral service yes. on uh, Monday yes. uh, next week, for uh, uh, Father, yes. and we just ask, Lord, that you bring uh, closure, Lord, to the uh, uh, family. Yes. Oh, Lord, yes. as, Lord, as soon as it is. Uh, 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 possible lord for their hearts to receive it lord and we just ask you lord we just uh, give you thanks and praise and, uh, uh, and now lord that you are a, a, a god who cares lord and we, we give you thanks <laughs> in uh, uh, excuse me amen. Thank, you. amen thank you jesus anybody want to pray for anything else before we before i get alan to close in prayer is anybody oh, for? there's the the government that you haven't uh, prayed for yet. I want to get Alan to do that now, uh, and I'm going to get Alan to pray from. Uh, All right. Alan. Yes, I want to pray for the government and his decision making. Uh, just your decision making, and just pray for my sister Denise for protection. I will do, no problem. Okay then. Lord, I thank you for being a good God. Thank you for being yeah. an amazing God, actually, Lord God. 
Yes. I'm praying for Vic's sister right now, Lord God. I pray you look after her in that home, Lord God, that you'll provide her the food. Well, I keep providing her with the food, warmth, and shelter in the home, and that the nurse is looking after her, Lord. And I pray that Mick will be able to see her, Lord God, and Bridie and the family. They'll be able to see her, Lord God, and you'll bless her, Lord God. We pray for this as we approach Christmas as well with the government restrictions, Lord. I pray you'll give the government wisdom and guidance to make the right decisions at the right time. If we drop to tier two, if we have to go on a tight lockdown, whatever the right decision is, Lord God, I pray you'll give them wisdom and guidance, Lord God. Thank you, Jesus, for being a great God. Amen. Amen. Thank Amen. you, Jesus. That's beautiful. Um, before I get Pastor Bill to close in prayer, our next prayer meeting is, and I'm, I'm just been talking to Joseph, I just announced this because Joseph is, he oversees all the prayers, so I'm just announcing on his behalf. Our next prayer meeting is going to be the 6th of January 2021. We're having a two week break. You can still pray at home and keep praying everything else, and you know, God answers prayer. Oh, that's the 7th of Jan, isn't it? 7th of Jan. 6th of Jan. The 6th, 6th of Jan, yes, yeah, sorry. Yeah, yeah. yeah our, our, our first prayer uh, meeting back in church is the 3rd of January, which is a Sunday. So it's yeah. yeah. Uh, there's, there, we have a Bible study next week on the 21st, and then we're taking a break, break for two weeks. So, Pastor Bill, will you close in prayer? I believe God's mm-hmm. blessed us tonight. Would you close in prayer for us? Thank okay. you. Okay. Yeah, uh, just before I pray, first okay. of all, I want to thank everyone for being faithful to these Zoom prayer meetings because we've been through difficult times, and we just thank you for your support and uh, for one another and for the church. And we believe in God for great things in 2021. And uh, we, we want to see things moving fast back into church. Yeah. And we just thank you once again for your faithfulness. So let's pray together. Father yeah. God, we thank you for this opportunity of coming together, Lord. And yeah. Lord, as we represent our congregation, our families, our neighborhoods, our employment, wherever we're from, we, we stand here week by week, representing them, oh God. And Lord, we know your hand is upon us, and we thank you, Lord, for the uh, wonderful things. Even though this year has been a bit of a blur, we've still continued. And Lord, we thank you for our building. We thank you for, Lord, the premises that we're able to do what we're doing uh, with the community, Lord, that it continues to grow, that new uh, paths open up for our community, new paths open up for um, new people in the church, new ministries. Yeah. Lord, I want to yeah. pray for next year, Lord, that we see an influx of young people, oh God, of families. And Lord, that we can see, Lord, your kingdom moving amongst us, your authority in our lives, oh God. Yeah. We, 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 we think of everybody, oh God, Jesus. especially Lord, those that we've not been able to get in touch with properly. Lord, yes. we lift them all before you right now. And Lord, we thank you, Lord, for your enduring faith in each and every one of us lord we just thank you oh god for the opportunity we've had to pray for the needs of our families and our church and our friends oh god and all the prayers we've made tonight we know that you're hearing oh god and we know that we have what we ask for and in faith lord we take it right now and lord i pray and thank you lord for this year even though it's been a dull year but yet lord we, we've made it, and Lord, we, yes. we continue into next year. Yes. Yes. Of, of healing, of vaccines, of Lord, knowledge, oh God. And uh, Lord, we pray for our governments as we have. We pray, Lord, for the Brexit. We pray, Lord, for uh, America, oh God. And we yes. pray, Lord, for the world, oh God, as Satan is making his move around the world. He's trying to reset, Lord, our financial establishments to control the world oh god and we just stand against it right now yes, through the precious name of jesus yes. we lord claim you as our lord uh, uh, as our king of kings and lord yes. lord. lord you're our sitting king oh god and we just give you all the praise nothing can take away yes. the name of jesus and we pray for your church worldwide right now oh god we pray for growth we pray for freedom we pray lord for the yes. gospel to go out in a in a revival way, oh God, yes. that we can turn upside down what's happening in our world today. Turn it right side up, I should say. Yes. And so, Lord, I do give you thanks tonight. Yes. Thank you, Father God. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. And that you be with us all and in us all and through us all. 
in the mighty name of Jesus. And I just want Amen. to thank all the leaders for Mick and Ken and Joseph as they've led these prayer meetings. We thank you, Lord, for their input in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. God bless you, folks. Have yes, a nice Mick. And, uh, yes.